Okay, we're here flying in the 701, getting ready to do a little fly uh, testing on our new flap handle for the 701. Um, we've uh, changed the flap handle to a more mechanical advantage over the existing flap handle. Um, it's a lot smoother in the air. You can deploy the flaps uh, right at the flap indicated airspeed at 60 miles an hour. Uh, before, I had to have it down almost in the 50s before I could deploy them. And now I can just use a one finger spring operated flap handle to uh, lower the flaps. I have zero to 15 degrees flaps, but I have a total of three positions now, whereas before I only had one position, either on or 15 degrees, which was nice, but now I can fine tune it. So if, you know, if I want to use a little, just a little bit of flaps for takeoff, I don't have to deploy them all. I can just go, you know, five or 10 degrees. So what we're going to do on the, on the takeoff here, we're going to go ahead and go to the second or third setting. Our second setting, we have three settings, and we're going to do a takeoff with the second setting, and we're going to climb out, stay in the pattern, and uh, bring up the flaps, enter a downwind, base to final, and then lower the flaps for full flaps on uh, landing. And we're going to do an engine check first, run it up seven uh, 4,000 RPM. Check the right, left, both, good, clear, controls clear and free. Now we're going to check them with the flaps all the way down. Check them all the way up. Controls nice and smooth still. We're going to lower the flaps to our third or second setting. Okay. Well, what we're going to do is going to get set up for a short takeoff, stick back. Yeah, Mexico traffic, Spam 701 is going to be departing runway 18, we'll remain in the pattern for Mexico. Okay, we're going to bring back the power, bring it, bring back the stick, nose comes up, and she's off the ground. Very quick takeoff. 701 is an awesome airplane. Okay, we're going to bring up the flaps. Very easy. One finger, brought them up. Okay. What I like about the 701 is you can remain in a very tight pattern but feel very safe in doing it. Some airplanes, uh, it just requires more space to turn. The reason we developed this new half flap handle is, is you know, the, 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 it's just a little bit harder sometimes if you got your bulky uh, coats on. Um, you got two people in here. You just don't have the the room to move to the, the leverage to lower the flaps. And the older we get, we get uh, we're not as strong as we used to be too. So you're actually pulling the flaps against the wind, which is sometimes very difficult. Mexico traffic spam is on the left down one through one eight Mexico. Typically I would lower the flaps, uh, beam the numbers, but today I'm gonna wait until I'm on final, lower the airspeed, and then uh, lower the flaps. And start bringing back power. And I will have to get it in the white arc, which is the flap uh, extended speed. Top of the white arc. Still not there yet. And we're on final. So now I'll bring it in the flap range, which you are. Bring in the first notch, second notch, and full flaps. Today we got about a, probably a 15 knot uh, wind right out of the southeast. So we're going to have to come in with a little bit of power. Keep the nose down, keep the airspeed up a little bit. Then we get close final, then I'll, lower, I'll bring the nose up. Very 
nice landing, even with a 15 knot cr uh, crosswind. And the flaps, we'll go ahead and bring them, uh, we'll bring them up to the third setting here and we'll back taxi. Actually, let's lose all the flaps for takeoff. So we deployed all the flaps, which is about just actually a little over 15 degrees. Back, add power. Okay, there we go. Lost transmission there. That was a really nice short takeoff. And it was probably, you know, 100 to 125 feet, but it's, you know, it's a 85 degree day, and, and I was holding back a little bit just because of the wind. The nice thing about the 701 is that instantly as you add power, the nose comes off, so you're not rolling on rough ground very long. All right, we're going to try things a little different. We're going to bring back the power of the beam to numbers. We're going to start lowering our flaps in the wide arc here. Okay, one in the wide arc. One notch, two notch, three notch. Lower the nose, start our descent. A little bit of wind there, pushing us around. 